and welcome to Diaspora Lifestyle TV. My name is Gladys Briggs and in this video, I'm going to be talking to you about how you can give your viewers uh, the best viewer experience by customizing your YouTube channel. This video is very special to me because I've done it in collaboration with my beautiful friend, Tammy from Simply Tammy. Uh, I met Tammy in one of my early days on YouTube and we were both grinding on, on, on Facebook and social media. And you know how you meet someone and you just connect with them and you find that you have a lot of things in common. I think that I met Tammy and we were both trying to grow our channels together and I found that she had a loving for uh, YouTube support and we just kind of connected that way and since then we've been trying to do something together so we did we've worked really hard to put this together um, for you um, so that we can give you the best uh, youtuber support growth for your channel um, if you haven't got simply Tammy uh, I'm going to just let simply Tammy introduce herself to you so that you can get simply Tammy as quickly as you can because you want uh, somebody that can give you uh, all of the tips that you need to grow your content. Hi everyone, my name is Tammy from my channel called Simply Tammy. I make videos on hair, makeup, beauty product reviews, lifestyle vlogs, chit chat, inspirational talks, as well as YouTube tips on how to do YouTube better on your PC or mobile phone. If any of this interests you, stop by my channel and check me out. Also remember, Gladys will be there too, so we'll see you there. Thank you for watching. Have you been to one of those channels on YouTube where the videos are all over the place? Sometimes they're cooking, sometimes it's a vlog, sometimes they're talking about issues, sometimes they do playing games and just all different types of content. Does that put you off or um, are, you, are you someone who has such uh, content yourself? Yes, are you a YouTuber who has such a channel where you want to try and showcase everything you have all in one channel? Yeah. I mean, it's bad enough that you have, um, it's bad enough that you have all of these different, um, types of content on your channel and people can't really place you. But when you add live stream, live stream videos to that mix, it just makes, it just takes your channel from, from hero to zero. That's the whole, like, it takes your channel from hero to zero because people come into your channel and you know, live streams, you're talking and shouting and connecting with people. And that is just, nobody knows, like, no, no viewer knows where to place that. So, um, you don't want that. You want your channel to be highly organized. So, um, come with me. Okay. So let me share my screen with you. I'm going to take you straight up to my, YouTube channel channel <coughs> so that's my YouTube channel yeah and this button right here that says customize channel that is the button that does the magic you can see my YouTube channel I do a lot of live streams as well because I'm still trying to grow my channel so and that is where I connect with my uh, with youtubers and my friends and everything so I do a lot of live streams and you can see that I have tucked my live streams away at the bottom of my channel because they do get your channel quite messy quite quickly as well. So I tucked them away and that's the button I used to create all of that magic. Uh, so once you click on that customize button, customize channel button, it kind of lets you um, rearrange your channel however you wish to rearrange it. So now you see the little pencil showing up there and you can feature one of your videos that you like. For your returning subscribers um, and you can then begin to uh, put your content group your content into different playlists yeah? you should have done this before you come to customize put your content and arrange them according to what you want your viewers to see because of course maybe you have a lifestyle channel and if you have a lifestyle channel then you might be cooking you might be traveling you might be doing shopping you might be doing all different types of things and you want to put them into a playlist and then you want to drop those playlists on your um, home, home page. So on mine, I've got my one hour playlist and I've also got my uh, uploads here, all uploads, another um, another playlist that I created that, that gives um, 
a viewer about eight hours watch if you just want to watch my content for eight hours i've got about eight hours in that one i've got one hour in that one if you just want to sit back and watch me for one hour i've got that in there and i've got my popular uploads uh on this one another tab here and i've got my travel uh travel um videos on this tab i've got shopping videos on this tab and gardening so who says you can't do everything <laughs> Timmy and I belong to a group of non-niche channels. So, uh, yeah, some of us are limitless. You know, some of us like to do a variety of things. So, uh, yeah, you can definitely do a variety of things, but you can group them uh, using playlists so that when somebody comes into your channel, they can they can take what they want from you. They can enjoy what you have to offer. Yeah, so uh, you can see that I've put my past live streams at the very bottom of my channel. So someone doesn't just come into my channel and all they see is me talking and shouting. Nope, that's right at the bottom. And all of these playlists, you can use the, the button to push them up if you want to see. Uh, I can push that, move that one up again, or I can move it down if I want to. Yeah. I can move it down if I want to. If I click on the little pencil by the side of it, it's going to let me um, decide whether I want to make a horizontal row or um, I want to change that playlist that I put in that one. Yeah, so if I, I don't want to do anything, I want to leave it as this because I love it as this. I'm just going to click on the cancel button and leave it as it is. Yeah, you can choose how many, however many you want to put on here. And on this bar here, I've got my featured channels. I've got my baby channel, Mass Junction. I was simply tell me on the top there and a few other friends and inspirational uh, YouTubers that I've got up there. Um, so yeah, and that's simply tell me if you don't have a uh, grab simply tell me she's one of uh, uh, the YouTubers that um, that inspire me. Okay. Um, yeah. So that's the button that helps you. Once you finished, you just click back out onto your home page. It takes you back to your home page, and you can definitely click back on your on your channel name and it takes you back to your home page and you can definitely see all of the things that you have arranged on your channel and see how beautiful they look i'm gonna take you through mine i've got my videos on this one <coughs> if you do live streams it's definitely worth it to um get a particular thumbnail that you can be using for your live streams and so that when somebody comes into your channel straight up they know that that is a live stream they don't want to watch that one. They want to go straight to something that they think they can enjoy. Yeah, because live streams are for maybe YouTubers. So, so definitely, um, yeah, those are my videos. And then uh, those are my playlists. I've got a few playlists in there. And uh, that's my community tab. For on my community tab, I've got uh, my last live stream that I had last weekend. Uh, this is Simply Timmy, uh, and uh, the, this is DM Vlogs Life. We had a collaboration at the beginning of the year, and this was when I hit my first 1K, um, and I just put that in a couple of weeks after that. I put that on just to uh, feel feel uh, good about my achievement. Those are my channels, uh, featured channels and subscriptions, and on my About tab, I have a lovely, um, a little, a lovely little write-up about myself there, and then you, YouTube does the rest for you. You can put your links in here, and when you put those links on the bottom there, it brings them right up to this corner here and puts them. I think you're allowed up to four links. Yeah, this one takes you to my blog. This one takes you to my website for maths, and it takes you to my Facebook page, my Twitter page, and my Instagram page. So yeah, you can see that's how you set up everything. And, Organize it so that if somebody's on your uh, your YouTube page, they can get a lot of information about you and they can have a lovely user experience. Thank you. Well, that's everything I have for you today. I hope you found that helpful. Um, yes, that's it. You want everything to be organized on your channel so that when viewers come in, uh, you can get them to... Um, See, choose from your a bunch of things that you have which category interests them and people when they like you they like you anyway they're still going to watch your content whether you're dancing or you're cooking or you're eating so put them in categories so that they can find what interests them using a playlist and then uh, let them have what they want from your channel yeah thank you for watching and I shall see you in another video bye